Hi Kickstarter, I'm Jake and I'm the founder of Cinch. Two years ago, he helped us win the ultimate pop-up tent to over 30 countries worldwide. And the response was phenomenal. You've proven that Kickstarter is the world's best focus group. And with your feedback, we've made even more improvements. I came to you with a vision for exceptional camping without compromise. You brought my dream to life. All the benefits of a regular tent plus tons more with none of the hassle. I've designed every cinch tent so you can attach a solar power pack. This captures solar energy on the roof of the tent and channels it inside through a weatherproof port into a pocket sized power bank which we've upgraded this year so it has three times the capacity of the previous model. The solar pack is so versatile. You can power all of your USB powered gadgets and there are two USB ports so you can power two devices at the same time. You can take the power bank with you on the move, just unplug it and slip it into your pocket. There are two entrances, each with their own porch, providing loads of functionality that you can tailor to your own needs. Unique to Cinch, each entrance had its own canopy with detachable poles, and new for 2016, it's a super extended canopy, which lets you extend your living space by an extra four square meters. All the kit packs nearly away into the bag. This year, each Cinch has two cool safety mirrors that attach to the inside of the tent. Cinch comes in three sizes, two, three and four person. Each one is the largest in its class and a format with over six and square metres of living space. It's the biggest pop-up tent in the world. Every tent is double skinned to stop condensation and we use advanced waterproof fabric which is three times the industry standard, giving you extra protection in really wet conditions. You don't want to get to a campsite and have to spend ages assembling your tent. You want to be able to enjoy yourself straight away and make the most of being outdoors. I came up with Cinch after years of going to music festivals and on camping trips and never finding a tent to suit my needs. I went through dozens of tents and the big manufacturers always let me down. The adventure doesn't end when the sun goes down. Nighttime is just as important as day and Cinch is fully equipped for the dark. Every Cinch is packed with LED tent pegs and two cool torches that turn into lanterns. And we've now made the light reflective guy lines glow in the dark. We designed a blackout canopy that also regulates the heat. It's super easy to put up in a matter of seconds. In the morning you can sleep in a tent as long as you want and still stay cool and comfortable. The tent pitches instantly and takes less than a minute to pack down to. Pop-ups are great, but you still want space, comfort and good quality materials. The sort of stuff you get when you spend the time in putting up a regular tent. I couldn't find my ideal tent anywhere, so I decided to make it myself. The criteria was non-negotiable. Light and easy to carry with everything packed together. Loads of cool features with some really serious kit underneath. Easy and fun, but made from the highest quality materials and built to last. In 2014, thanks to you, the Kickstarter community, we were able to produce Cinch on a bigger scale than ever before. It was a massive success, but it's only the beginning. That jump taught me loads about the large scale manufacturing process and made it clear that we can go even further. The next generation Cinch is ready to go. Testing is complete and our manufacturer is fully briefed. We just need your help to finish buying materials and get production underway. In return, you'll get the new and improved cinch before anyone else in early 2017. There's some really cool extras, so just take a look at the rewards to see what's on offer. You have confirmed my belief that cinch is the ultimate pop-up tent. Let's make the hassle of camping a thing of the past and give people an experience that's fit for the great outdoors.
is a new kind of electronic music instrument that's meant to combine the best of the old and the new. We've tried to put digital power and flexibility used by DJs and music producers into a package that is simple, beautiful, and expressive, like an acoustic instrument. The Mune is completely wireless and easy to pick up. It connects to an endless variety of apps to allow musicians to do anything from playing melodies on the synthesizer to sequencing drum beats to mixing and controlling effects. Finally, we see this as an instrument for the music producer that goes beyond just playback of melody and rhythm. The Mune is built for shaping sound in whole new ways. We started building the Mune a few years ago, when my friend, composer Andrew Staniland, realized that he was not satisfied with performing electronic music using current interfaces. I found that when I was making music with um, very dynamic classical performers, where there's a very clear cause-effect relationship between the you know, emotion and the sound, uh, I found that I was really at a, at a disadvantage of making music electronically, because while I was doing all of, a lot of things live on stage like the other musicians, there was no uh, analogous cause effect uh, between you know my action and the sound that came out of it. So I wanted to uh, I wanted to explore that and, and and explore some different options for a way to make an instrument out of a, out of a controller rather than just having a controller be a technical piece of gear. Current digital controllers are awesome. I use them a lot myself uh, when performing. But in many cases, they leave the audience a bit alienated from the creative process, as they can't see or understand what the musician is actually doing. They are also not simple to pick up and just start playing. Software configuration can often take way too much time. And thirdly, many controllers are just not built with expressiveness as the top priority. We set out to build something that felt as expressive as an instrument like a guitar. We're launching a crowdfunding campaign to cover the tooling and manufacturing costs of our very first run of units. We've been through four major rounds of prototyping over about four years. Like many hardware products, the cost to start production will be quite expensive. As a supporter, you would become a Mune Explorer and help guide the future development of the Mune. Mune comes from the word commune, and we see this as not just a campaign to get our first units out there, but as a way to start building a community of supporters and developers, creating a truly great electronic music instrument and shifting thinking about electronic music performance is going to require a large movement far beyond what we've created. If you think we can work together to make electronic music performance more simple, expressive and engaging, please consider participating in and sharing our campaign. Thank you. Most women blow dry their hair in front of their bathroom sinks, losing a little bit of hair each time. This hair eventually makes its way down the sink, creating a clog. These clogs can be expensive and difficult to fix. That's why we created Clog Stopper, to prevent clogs before they start. Now with Clog Stopper, when my drain starts to slow, I can fix it myself in seconds. And the Clog Stopper also catches jewelry. Take a look for yourself.
This is iProtect, a private safety mobile app, free and available to everyone. It enables you to receive personal assistance in the event of a natural disaster or a terrorist attack. The alerts are received in real time by our 24-7 coordination center and are managed individually to send you the correct emergency service. Our unique alert system uses the latest localization and communication technology. It allows us to send alerts to all our users, notifying them of significant events happening all over the world. For a minimal fee, you also have access to three more personal safety services. By pressing and holding your smartphone screen, you activate the Safe Walk service, your personal and silent bodyguard. In so doing, we can see that you are in an unsafe place and we are on alert. If you are threatened, simply remove your finger from the screen and the alert is raised. We continually stay in contact with you and alert the police services of your exact location. In the event of a medical emergency, our medical alert service allows you to call upon iProtect members trained in first aid, as well as our coordination center. Whilst you are being treated at the scene, we are coordinating with the emergency services. Both elderly citizens, as well as young children, can soon find themselves in difficulty. In the event of a missing person, the first few minutes are crucial. So we have developed a unique and immediate alert system which activates not only our coordination center, but also those iProtect members nearby. And to all those who reply to the alert, we allocate a specific search area. with the aim of locating the missing person as quickly as possible. To avoid the unthinkable happening. But also to provide to our most vulnerable people the particular attention they deserve. Combining a unique alert system and a professional coordination center, iProtect offers you the best service in personal protection. What we have is a new type of engine that we've never made before. It's a Manson engine. Manson engines were invented by someone called A.D. Manson in 1952. Manson engine shares some similarities with Stirling engines, but has some fundamental differences. In essence, it's almost like a simple Stirling engine. Last year, we ran a successful Kickstarter campaign with our Nano Cannon Stirling engine. While I was developing that engine, I came up with the idea to make a whole family of different hot air engines, all based on a similar design. So this next project is our Manson hot air engine and we're calling it the nano disc engine. All Manson engines rely on valves opening and closing at the top and bottom of the piston stroke for their operation. For this nano disc engine I have developed what I think is a unique valve arrangement. I can't say too much about this at the moment because there are patent applications pending but tests have shown a significant improvement in performance. One of the interesting things about Manson engines is the noise they make, which can be described as a burbling, purring noise. This is caused by the valves opening and closing 30 times a second. And there we have it, Nano Disc Manson Engine by Contacts.